Hey, this one's a little bit different. The head is sealed off through the inflating. I'm looking straight through the mouth. My visibility is really poor on this one. No, the head isn't inflating. It's got like foam or something. Okay, I see. It, it's not a viewport. This one doesn't have a viewport in it. It's it's complete. It's just plain mesh here. So yeah, it has to be sealed off like this. Guys, I can't see anything. I got to think so. I, I was hoping I'd be able to uh, see how I was walking through and how it would look. I can barely see anything. <laughs> Is I, I've got to stick my head all the way up uh, through the mouth. The view, viewport is in the mouth. <laughs> I was hoping that I'd only have to be able to fix the spines on this. If, I'm, if I've got the, uh, the head strapped around my forehead, it's okay. I can only see through. Oh, but the, yeah, that head looks completely scrunched. Well, if the whole thing would have inflated, then the head might have been redeemable. As far as comfort, overall, it's, it's not bad if the viewport were right here, like every other inflatable costume. Let's see, if it were inflated out like it was supposed to be, it it'd be like this okay yeah i'm i'm gonna have to do some modifications put some material there so it'll inflate all the way and put a viewing port in the neck because yeah you can you can see if if that's not blocked off all the air is going straight out as soon as that neck area thing gets blocked off, you can see how much better it inflates. So Ruby's Godzilla costume is a bit of a mess, really. Start with the uh, the rear zipper. This is a 36 inch zipper, as opposed to the 44 inch on pretty much every other inflatable costume everywhere. The fan came with an attached Thing. I'm, I get it, this is an older costume, okay. Got a video coming up to rectify that. The head, you have a sleeve that goes over your neck, then the inside of the mouth is where you're supposed to be looking out. That's just made out of mesh, so it's not sealed off at all. The tongue was blocking my eyes. I fixed that already, along with, along with the teeth. Yeah, it, it was just stitched on the outside. You can tell there's a, a tough felt material inside here. And that was supposed to help it keep its form while you were wearing the costume. It didn't. The spines are a, a couple random pieces of felt. They look horrible. <laughs> the costume overall, okay, I admit it was relatively comfortable. But it's got so many other things I didn't even focus on that. If you want to talk about floppy foot issue, this is major floppy foot. All the other costumes have three toes. This thing's got four you gotta deal with. The felt toes, but it gets so jumbled up. I am gonna be fixing this with my modifications. When you look at the tail, it was decently long. I didn't notice this when I was testing it out, but I guess somewhere, that, yeah, right here, there's a little piece of Velcro. You can attach that so it's looking like, like he's swinging his tail or something. Oh, guys, I, I hate to bash on costumes, especially the, uh, the Godzilla. I love Godzilla. <laughs> As it comes out of the box, say two out of five. There's things visually they could have done a lot better there's things uh, 
mechanically they could have done a lot better. I am trying to rectify that. I'm not really great at how-to videos, so chances are I'm just going to go and make all the modifications and get that taken care of. Go over and check me out on Patreon, help me support the channel, get more costumes, support you guys. Until next time, take care.